Greg, you're doing a, an interesting uh, workout there with Tyke Furlong. Can you talk us through what that's for? Um, well, he's obviously not playing this week, and uh, for for a lot of the boys, they do a lot of conditioning in the gym, and some of it uh, we try to transfer into a game specific. And obviously, being a front rower, it, it helps to just um, get a, a, a feeling of what it's like under a bit of fatigue. He's been doing some running, so at the end of training, we just try to get some scrum work into him, um, and I think it sort of keeps him chipping away as well. It's good. Looking forward to the match tomorrow. What are you expecting from the front row? Um, a lot of hard work, I hope, um, and it'll be tough. I think uh, you know uh, the preparation's been pretty good. The boys have been um, you know limited preparation, but I think the the best thing about that is there's a bit of nerves, there's a bit of like oh, I've got to get this right. So um, I think uh, we're in a reasonably good place. So we'll see how it goes. How difficult is it for those kind of new combinations to to gel together in the front row? Yeah, I mean, we had one session yesterday, um, had about uh, probably 10, 10, 12 minutes. And I think the key for that is what we do probably off the pitch. And, um, and we all um, kind of know the systems now. A lot of the guys have been in the environment. And uh, the key probably thing is too is with the provinces and how they do things and how well they're going. And obviously that's going well. So um, we've just got to try and transfer that as quick as we can. Greg, thanks very much. Thank you.